Javante stay, still so, buying. So yep. stays in there for you. Yes, sir. I can't argue with that. I could have put him in there. I shoved him down one tier. That's I, and I couldn't. And I think that was I, when I was talking earlier with someone about my rankings. I think having him in this tier at this high with the injury and it could be a little bit more than just the ACL. It could be a bit of a concern, but I mean, what would the Broncos just bring in Chase Edmonds? I'm I'm not. I'm not worried about his situation being worse next year. Melvin's going to be gone. Latavius going to be gone. The Broncos want in Chase. Mm-hmm. That was part of the Chubb deal. Yes. Right. Correct. Um, yes. Could they draft a running back? Sure, but I don't know why they would. I'm not worried about that necessarily. It's more of like this Broncos offense. Like it's not like, it like you know get, what I it mean. It can't get worse. It can't get worse. He's a good player. I'm not too concerned about the injury. You were. You knew Melvin was in there, but he was still really young, so you were buying him, right? And he was properly rated as – I probably had him – let me check my other tier from the beginning of the year. I definitely had him in tier two. Uh, and Javante. Yeah, because, you know, he was 22 and a pretty good player and should have been a – you were very intrigued by this offense in yeah. preseason. Yeah. And it's like – you know, they pulled it together and beat the Jags. I don't know if that's fuck. which the Jags have been in every game and are better than their record is. They just are blowing it at the worst fucking times. Yeah. And they haven't figured out how to win yet. Right. And like, so I don't know that the ship's right. I mean, I don't think the ship's right per se, but I think there's a lot of pieces there that are, that are intriguing. I mean, you have they didn't three. get rid of Judy. You didn't get rid of Judy. You still they didn't get rid of Hamler either, who was also being shopped as well too, because he was more affordable than Hamler. Mm-hmm. You still have Sutton there. You've got a em, maybe emerging rookie tight end. Yep, Dulcich looks good. Your Russell, def- Russell your, did hit him with that. Let's ride, baby. At the end of the your interview, your defense just Jags got worse by, tr- like that. by trading Chubb. I know they just got some guy from the Jets as well too, but he's obviously they not. got a they got a, a pick back from trading away they got a first round pick back i believe right yes they did he was the fifth ever player to get traded for a first round pick in the middle of the season yeah um i'd probably bump i'd probably bump javante out of this tier solely because and i guess you could maybe make the case a little bit for swift in that in this regard a little bit um but i feel comfortable if swift's on the field the usage will be proper i just i'm just slightly concerned about the broncos uh, willingness to use Javante. It's not Javante. I don't think it's a Javante problem. I think I'm more concerned with the Broncos' willingness and how they're deploying running backs currently we, is what's is what's bogging me down. And, and a little bit of the injury because of it hasn't been quite the bounce back with everybody like you'd hope it'd be, especially if there's multiple ligament tears. You got to be maybe, but it's early enough in the season or yeah. was early enough in the season. Sure. I'm okay with that part of it. It's mostly the way that the Broncos have been using the running backs that I don't love. There's also a decent chance that Nathaniel Hackett doesn't make it to year two. That's fair. I mean, new ownership coming in there. They've seen it. They're not looking great. And they have a ton of money. The Waltons, a ton right? of money. The they have kind money. of reassured it and basically be like, we like Nathaniel. We like what's going on. We great. Like, you know, <laughs> I mean, you know, they don't have to say anything, yeah. but they, they have said that they're not looking to make a change. But I think it's... Well, they won. I think finally. it's okay to to let the Hackett have some growing pains here sure. and give him another give him another chance. So I, you know, or you know, if I you want to go the other way, but maybe they let him stay the season. But if he doesn't show, if it doesn't start going in the same, yeah. if it doesn't keep going in the same direction, but I, you know, I I just. Is Russell Wilson a system quarterback? I mean, look what Geno Smith do. You know, like yeah. he's I don't, like I, you know, I, no one has made more fun of. Like you got a fucking kicker taking shots at this man, like yeah. you know, like it's just and no it's one also cares. The greatest kicker of all time, right? But like no one cares. Like no one's like, it's just. I did enjoy that he he hit you with the let's ride, baby, at the very end of the the post game interview. But like, because he's kind of owning it, you know, which is good because it, it's like the he's like the laughing stock of the NFL. He's like, literally no the one, corniest person on the face of earth. Right, yeah. it's terrible, and I just I just couldn't squeeze him in this tier. Do you, Casey, do you have Swift in this tier? I would put Swift, uh, uh, yeah, in this tier. Do you have him? I'll, I'll throw Kenneth Walker in there, too. Okay. 